I don't think I'm over. I don't think I'm over what happened to Lee yet. I think I am. Oh, it's beautiful. Uh, my choice is locked. So I haven't made any yet. Zaddicks. Way too excited for Spyro. I, I'm intrigued, but I don't think I'm gonna get it when it first comes out. Like, I'm intrigued, but not, like, to a ridiculous extent. Like, kind of like I was with Crash. Like, I can go without playing the whole Crash remastered thing, so... Let's play subtitles. Sure. That way I can read if I talk over something. Uh, standard works. Alright, cool. Let's do this! Let's get the show on the road. For those of you who uh, haven't already bailed after you were here, hockey-wise, I'm sorry, but... You know, we, we do play other things, but thanks for hanging out. Uh, so it, it loaded up my stuff, right? That's what just happened? I believe so. I think it, it must have loaded up my previous choices. Change save file. Save file one, two, one, fuck. Okay, well I guess we're fine. It's not the option to import. Maybe it happens after I hit the button. As long as it imported my previous decisions, import season one save. There we go. That's what I was looking for. Season two of the Walking Dead builds off of season one's choices. The game will not automatically search your console. That's fine. That's what I wanted. Just wanted to make sure. Save file found. I need to choose a save slot from season one. Cool. That must be weird. It's just like, what am I doing? Completed season one. There we go. We're good to go. We're continuing right where we left off from. All right, cool. Let's do it. Previous the continued adventures. Ah, Lee, I'm not over this yet. Damn it. What's your name? I'm Clementine. You've been all by yourself through this? <laughs> not over this. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. It's how the world works now. I shouldn't have stabbed you. Are those bad people dead? I hope you know what you're doing with her. I got it. You sure Mommy did. Crawford is the only place left in Savannah. Bojo, what's up, buddy? People. You just missed the ultimate you franchise meme. Mom and dad are. Okay, you can come. The but ultimate franchise meme. Quiet. Clementine, Clementine. And there's the bite. It all went to shit. No. Joe, no, or Joe dead, Corvo for Jason Arnett. Should I take it? She wouldn't uh, be exposed to what she has been with probably. you. Probably. Depends on what you need Is it Die. random debut? Hell of a shot, Clem. Lee, Hell of a shot. I saw my parents. Yeah, you did. Come here, sweetie. Yeah, you did. You did we'll see your parents, didn't you? Lee, no. That don't mean it, Krista. I mean, Lee and Fair. Well, yeah. I was gonna say, we could have just shot ourselves, but we had to teach her the lesson. We had to, uh, we had to teach her the lesson of, uh, putting people down, I guess. Ultimate meme is actually where I post more than two videos in a week. Well, you know. But the high quality nature. Right? It's all about that high quality. Ah, uh, here we go. We're back. It builds character. It does. Yeah, Dag, fair point. He might not have. What do you think? Oh, Mead, you can't be serious. I am. We are not doing that. Hey, well, I guess we found because... him. Because. Astral. I mean, all the more reason to Come stay on, around and enjoy. This. We're not calling our baby Omid. I Wonder mean, do you really that. enjoy what I do? Clementine, if you don't stick helping. around when I switch games, I mean, Omid come on. The second. No. Omid Jr. No. You have to admit it has a ring to it. Yeah, the ring of an egotistical maniac. What if it's a girl? Then we name her Krista. But I'm Krista. I don't want to call her Krista. That's just confusing. So name her Genevieve. I don't care. 
How can you not I care? Watch the first. You just saw the recap of the first. You're not taking this. Seriously. They just showed the recap. What's the matter with you? Especially little Omi's future. All the more reason to jump on now, because we still got three games to go, buddy. Remember that time in Barstow? Vegas weekend. Why don't you uh, uh, get cleaned up in the girls' room, Clem? I hope the sink works in there. I wouldn't count on it. Just be careful and make sure to keep track of your things. We'll be right next door. Okay. Oh boy. Damn recap doesn't show the emotion of the live thing. Well, that's your well, fault. You should have been here for the first one. Now you learned your lesson that you don't want to miss anything. Now you learned your lesson that you definitely don't want to miss me playing through the rest of the series. This is game two out of four, buddy. We got a lot left. I never noticed those looks before. Well, you know. Phew. Granted, I don't know if quote-wise this has been up to an Uncharted level. Maybe it has. Have I played through this one as well? Uh, Bojo, I've seen the majority, if not all of Season 2. Some of the details are a bit fuzzy. It depends on kind of what happens. Like, I might remember some details. I think I know... Like, I'm going to throw out the Carver name. Like, I remember that whole to-do. And I remember something about Kenny at a restaurant. <laughs> Spoiler alert, Kenny lives. <laughs> That's all I remember. I say, well, you know, so it's like I remember those details, but not... That's a problem. Oh, so... Gross. I don't know. So, like I said, the further into Season 2 we get, it's going to be a little bit more fuzzy for me. Do I need to know the show? Not at all. It is basically completely separate from the show. I did see the Kenny reveal. I remember the... Yeah, I know the whole Kenny thing, but I don't remember what the deal was. Like, so I'm fuzzy on that. I really don't feel like staying up till 1am. Yeah, shook. I was gonna say. I mean, that's the thing. If someone's like, hey, I gotta go to bed because I'm a normal person. And hey, I completely get it. <laughs> Trust me. I get it. Get it. But yeah, this has nothing to do with the show, pretty much. Same universe. Like, there's a couple of characters that every once in a while, at least in the first game, there's one character from the show, Glenn, who just pops in for, like, a cup of coffee, and then he's gone. So, you know. Damn graphics. Better. Stupid. Need more boats. <laughs> I like to think at the end of this, Kenny opens up bo uh, a boat emporium. Did it not roll under that one? Peekaboo. No? I guess it rolled under the final one. That's one dirty ass water bottle. You take what you can get, though, man. Hey. Get ready for the jump scare! You. Yeah. Not a jump scare, but a person! My psychotic physics teacher would drive people more crazy on my sleep. Well, you know. Always keep your gun on you, Clem. Get out of my shit! Always keep your gun on you. What are you doing? Just falls and bashes her face on the toilet and dies, and that's the end of it. You're supposed to run for your gun, not hide, right? I think she knows. Hello. I see you. Yeah, you do, don't you? Get out of there. You're not fooling me. <sighs> Come on out now. Leave me alone. Don't think I will. You Why should, not? though. Are you stupid or something? Get out here. You're pointing a gun at a kid, lady. How do, how do you feel about that? The water's still cleaner than Michigan's? It might be. 
You got anything on you? Come on, let's see. Uh, I ain't gonna ask again. Yeah, no, shut your face, lady. That's all I have. That's it? How'd you make it this long? I'm serious. What else you got? That's it. Don't lie to me. I'll pop you. Give me what you got. She had to say pop. Are we gonna be a tad bit? I'm not screwing around. Come on. Uh, I don't have anything. Give me that hat. No. Where'd you get it? I, I fucking found it. My dad gave it to me. Just give it to me. What the fuck is it? Why are you stealing a cat? A, a, a cat? The Catkinsons. Why are you stealing a, a, a hat from a fucking nine-year-old? Who might be ten at this shit, point. Shit and more shit. That's even worse than stealing her cat. nothing good. Not like the last people I got. They had all kinds of good shit. Well, me, you'd do something. That was a good catch. You ain't got nothing good. How's the audio, by the way? Is it loud enough fish. when I don't talk over it? You gonna cry, little fish? Come on, Omid. Make daddy? a move. What a bozo. <gasps> Omid, are you fucking stupid? I mean, you just got shot, so you might be. Well, say goodbye to little Omid. <laughs> Boy. Just a flesh wound. Like the door closed behind him and he just he freaking jumped out of his skin. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. Popper. Yeah, you better put your hands up. Good shot. Good. Oh, she just blind fired a rifle. <laughs> Whew. Omid, you weren't cut out for this world. Omid, did you hear me? Omid. <laughs> like, you didn't have to scream and charge, but... What? She took my gun. Maybe you shouldn't have left a nine-year-old alone. Don't look at me like it's my fault. You're the one that told the nine-year-old to go to the other bathroom while you two were doing God knows what. And then he's the one who tried to sneak up behind her instead of just making a couple steps, slapping that shit out of her arm, and it would have been fine. Krista. Is this still going to be in it? 16 months. Jesus Christ, is that much of a time jump? Omid's been dead for 16 months, which means it's been like two years for Lee. Christ. He's been... He's been dead for like two years? Krista, talk to me. Sixteen months later and you're still not over it to the point where you won't talk to me and you're blaming me. Sixteen months later and you're still blaming me. This will never work. Unbelievable. Look at this. It's pathetic. The You're wood's pathetic. too wet to burn. You're too wet to burn. So that does white what? At this rate, we'll be eating this for breakfast. What else can we do? Find something that'll burn, maybe. I don't know. Won't be easy in the dark. How about your coat or your you face? You doing this, not me. Smoot, I miss Doug every Kindling day. a fire so you can cook and stay warm. It's something you have to be able to do, Clementine. Otherwise. Oh God, let's not bring up Omid, even though I hate her. We can't stay in one place too long. It's too dangerous. We need to keep moving. All we do, all we have ever done is move. But we never seem to get it. You're being snippy with a child. I'm freezing. You think this is bad? Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about cold. If we make it. We still have a couple hard months ahead of us. This rain will turn to sleet, then ice, then snow. It won't be easy. Why did we go so far north? 
Oh boy. Can we make it that far? Maybe. I don't know. Why'd we go we'll so far north? It doesn't make sense. We sure as hell can't stay here. Like, I'm sorry, but if this happens, I am leaving this state and going south. It's the only way I'm going south, because fuck the south. <laughs> In a general weather sense, totally, and that's what I mean. Uh... I'm not bringing up Lee. I'm, gonna I'm not doing it. I'm not you doing just it. Keep the fire lit. I should bring up Omid just to piss her off. I'd never survive in the south. Probably not. I'd be the one guy in a zombie apocalypse to fucking, like, you know, get killed by an alligator or something. Is it alligators or crocodiles in the south? Or both? Probably both, because people love to freaking bring them. Bitch, it goes rain, snow like substance, snow. Yeah, it's called sleet. Ah, oh, the picture of Lee. I don't want to look at Lee. Just let him go. Ah, oh, Lee. You are, you are quite dead. All right. Ah, Kenny. You, you're probably, you, I think you are still alive. Your family's quite dead. Yeah, let's just pick up later. You know the custom draft classes were in 2K19 10 years ago? I did! Which, yeah, is rough. Pyro's unreadable if you're on dark mode, which you shouldn't be. At least I don't like being on dark mode, I don't know why. Alright! Yeah, controlling a nine year old now. Look at campfire. Well, there's nothing to do. Alright. Can I. You know, I steal from her shit? No? Okay. Bad dig, I was aware of that. It's very upsetting. Almost as upsetting as uh, having to walk all the way around to this side of the fire. So there is that. That's weird. Why? It wasn't command, though. Alright. Press and hold the A button to flick the lighter, then push the left stick towards the deal. I'll do it. Let's go ahead and light up this... <laughs> this. Is this supposed to be a squirrel? Because it's a big fucking squirrel. Or is it supposed to be a different kind of rodent? That's still not enough. The flames are too low. Clementine started the fire. Alright, let's just go ahead and uh, go ahead and toss this here right on there and we'll be fine. This might burn. This random piece of wood that dumbass Krista was probably stepping on and not using. Damn it, Krista. Uh, I am not burning the photo of Lee. You can kick rocks on that one. We'll burn the log. I think I'm gonna burn my picture of Lee or Kenny. Get out of here. Granted, it's a drawing of Kenny, but still. Uh-oh. Who's in the background? I might be. There's people in the woods. Burns great paper. That's true. So does wood. Which is where paper comes from. Where's the rest of your crew? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. She's lying. Cut the shit, lady. It's it's just me. Come on, guys. She's not saying. Oh God, do I leave Krista? <laughs> oh, I hate her so much. But do I leave her? Do we leave Krista behind? Or do we try to help her build a wicker man? <laughs> I agree. Do we, uh... Do we ditch Krista, guys? I want to know opinions here before we make this decision. I'll... I'll leave you in. Wow! And I thought I disliked Krista. Shit. Anybody want to throw some support her way, or are we just sneaking away? <laughs> 
I guess we're leaving Krista behind. Dag is the one person who's shown some sympathy. The one person. All right. Lemur and Dag, the only two arguing. You're very much outnumbered. Hey. You expect us to believe you're out here all alone? Oh. I'm sorry. I couldn't do it. I couldn't leave her. I think she's getting assaulted now anyway. <laughs> it just didn't feel right. I'm sorry. I tried to help her at least. I want to say that I tried. She might still die, but... Here, girl. I'm not around. At least I can rest easy. How the hell did he even see me? He was looking the other way. Holy nice slide. Head safe. Bomba. This is more Batman esque. Get sticked. Are you fucking kidding me? I just stabbed you with a stick. Get bit. Toss him. Send him in a van down by the river. Say goodbye to your finger, buddy. Huh? Kick him. Kick him. Give up, fucker. You're having trouble grappling with a fucking nine-year-old. Probably ten at this point. Like, I am ten. How big of a bitch are you? Get zomboed. Ah, oh, damn it. Kick him into the zombo. Well, that could be problematic. Okay, Krista, this has turned out to be more trouble than it's really worth. Maybe I should have just left you behind. Ah, oh, get eaten. That's what happens. Ah. Ah. Into the river! One rock to rule them all. And we're dead. Frozen to death. That is hypothermia. I'm fucking not of a power of ten year old. Adults in the future. She's dead. Like, I'm sorry. That water is way, way too rough to not just be pulling her under. <laughs> Unless she's a phenomenal swimmer. She might be a prodigy. So see, I have a feeling that would have happened anyway. But then Krista would have come back and just been like, Oh, well you didn't even try to help me, so go fuck yourself. And I feel like that would have, that would have caused issues down the road. And I'm dead. That's how the story ends. I drowned in a river. Oh, no, okay. Or not. Or not. It's fine. We're fine. We'll be fine. Well, I'm sorry. She. How is she not frozen to death already? Hello? Brandy, tutor. You're out of work now. Alright, can I go this way? Nope. She seems very disinterested in going said way. Look at the canoe. I think that's seaworthy. I finally found, uh,. I finally found Kenny's boat. Turned out though it's not a boat, it's a canoe. Canoe's a type of boat. Specifics, details. That plot armor, right? Omid would have died, right? All right. Boat. It's a boat. Grab the stairs. That looks sturdy. Nice job. Jesus Christ. She's the... She's the... She's the greatest athlete of our time. Krista, are you there? Nice vert, right? She runs a 4-4, four, four too. 
Look at grave. Walk to trail. Look at dead walker. Let's look at the dead walker first. Really enjoy the scenery. Ah! That's... That's pleasant. So who died? I'm gonna guess there's a marker on these twigs. Okay, nice dramatic effect. She's also an Olympic athlete, which means she's juicing. <laughs> Soon to be member of the Little Giants. This is just a continuation. This is just a continuation of the Gigantes. I mean, I'd be... Like, this is home sweet home for me. You're in my type of... You're in my neck of the woods. Good stuff. Can I go back? I want to go back. Oh, shit. I probably could. I don't want to get stuck in a cutscene. Screw it. We're walking. We're talking. Warning sign. What do we got? Snakes and bears. And lions and tigers. Black bear, coyote, mountain lion, poisonous snakes. Okay, well, outside of the poisonous snakes, I mean, yeah, we're... This is home sweet home for me. I know you're from Georgia, but shit. No 10 out of 10 baseball slide there that time. I'm not used to this reticle that they have this time, though. They changed it up. I hate this bit. This bit promised me. They promised me to do it as fast as possible. I'm very confused. I don't remember this part at all, but I'll do what I can. She's going through roid withdrawals. Yeah, this is actually Nathan Gerby. Uh, but much like Bane in Batman Forever, once he's unplugged from the Venom, he just starts to shrink. So. This is the Nathan Gerby origin story. Alright, let's be on edge. Sneaky, sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky. Ah, jump scare. You didn't get me. It's fucking cold, why are there poisonous snakes? Yeah, they're probably dead for the season, but I tend to agree. Can I not run? I can't. You're just gonna try to hit me with another jump scare. It's a dog. It's a woofer. Hello, woofer. Sam. Sam's angry. It's okay, boy. It's okay. Take off the hat. Dogs don't like hats. That's what it is. Don't pet the dog, don't check the collar. So, where are your owners? I'll talk to you as if you're gonna answer me. You don't put your hands near a strange dog, damn it. I'll be damned if I'm putting my hands anywhere near that dog. Petition to name your second dog, Sam. It depends. I don't have one yet, by the way. But potentially. Hey, what'd you find, boy? Where are you going? Wait up. He's not gonna answer you. He's not a food wrapper. Why does it say food wrapper? What the fuck? Why did it say food wrapper? Did that load up before it was supposed to? Alright, well the dog's in his creepy ass eyes seems to enjoy my company now Hello? at this point. His owner was the guy you stabbed in the chest with a stick. He looks pretty run over, but you never know. Yeah, remember what happened last time you, you stole shit out of a friggin' vehicle? Let's look around for some food. I have a buddy now. All right, well, let's look in the trash first and foremost. Gotta check everywhere. Yes, you do. We're going dumpster diving. Well, here we go. You didn't. Oh, there you go. Now you're trying. Oh my god. Thank you. Look, a can. Indeed. <gasps> and he wants the now whole fucking thing. Something to open it with. And he wants the whole fucking thing. 
He's, uh, he's not gonna share. Just dump the trash on the floor. It would've been the best, too much noise, though. Would've been the best way to do it, though. Please let there be something good in there. Probably not. What's in the cooler? It's somebody's oh, head. God. Oh. <coughs> I am so sick of that smell. Somebody's head. Do, 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 do. Barbecue. What do we got over here? We have a tent. And another can. I'll go back to the barbecue pit in a second. Use your teeth. Yeah, you're, you're not opening a can with Empty. your teeth, buddy. Better keep not looking, boy. Oh, that dog's gonna be a problem. It's not much of a tent anymore. I bet scavengers tore it apart. Doesn't matter how much of a how much of a friend you think your dog is. If it's hungry, mm mm, you are uh, you are not friends. Hey, he doesn't have the energy play? to fetch. You want to play catch? There's no way he has the energy to fetch. Sick catch. Okay, bring it back. What a good boy. Good boy. Good boy. What a good boy. All right. Uh, we don't need to throw that again. Uh, other tent. Search box. Please. Well, that's just not a horrifying nightmare. Mm, nothing edible. Sorry, right, just get tossed back in the box. Has lines from three and a half years ago were totally different now, except for Gallier. Sounds about right. What's in the van down by the river? It's not close enough to the river, but still, first overall doggo. Brady's new uh, number one target, Sam the doggo. Looks oh, like boy. we were a happy family once. How'd the dog outlast everyone else? Alright. Well, we got the barbecue pit, I guess. Anything? No food here either. I'm not looking for food. I'm looking for something to open the damn thing. This the only thing I didn't do was look at that tent 99 spectacular catch. Right? All right. Think anyone's been sleeping in here? I can't tell. Maybe we better not wait around to find out. Okay. Where is said? I can't go that way. So where the hell is said can opener? It's not in the tent. It's not in the van. It's not at the barbecue pit. The hell? It's not in the van. It wasn't over here anywhere. It wasn't in the garbage. It's not on the friggin' floor. How the, where the fuck do I go to, to open this? There you go. Now you're barking. Hey boy, what's the matter? Danger. Shh, we have to be quiet. Okay, I'm not going to, uh... Oh, hello! And there's my can opener. Hello? It's okay. He's dead. No, he's not. Look, you can see the bite. Looks like he tried to cut it out. Ah, oh, buddy. Well, we know what happened to the dad of the family okay. now. We're smart. He's not. We're smarter than all of them. You sure are. Which is why uh, I really don't want to, uh, yeah, let's, let's be smart, shall we? Just go ahead and... Stand back, okay? And go ahead and, uh, bop him. Shkabam! Is he one and done? He's one and done. All right. Nope, nope, he's still kicking. Stab him with the pointy end. Don't just bop him. Stab him with the pointy end. It would be much quicker. 
there an option to just stab you? Nope, gotta just keep bashing you. How does this dog feel about me, uh... Just repeatedly hitting its old owner upside the head with a giant stick? See? We just have to stay out of their reach. Indeed. This friggin' dog. Uh, search pocket. I just want to make sure you're dead. I'm gonna I search like to that pocket that really quickly. If they were alive, they probably want to help you. Nothing. Yeah. All right. Let's grab my can opener. <sighs> Still pretty sharp. Okay. Well, now we're getting some. All right. This dog is going to be a real piece of shit. This dog is going to be a real piece of shit. Please Very sanitary. Don't I don't think we have time to worry about proper sanitation right now. Good stab. Of course, I wouldn't recommend stabbing towards yourself like that, but what do I know? I'm just an adult. Allegedly. <sighs> Thank God. Oh, God. All right. Um... Don't bite my hand, fucker. Pretty hungry too. I'm pretty sure feeding him is a bad thing, because he gets really aggressive. Uh, B to back out. Fuck. Doesn't he bite me if I try to feed him? I don't want to get bit. <laughs> feeding dog. Walking dead. Season 2. Hold on. I don't want to get fucking bit. I don't want to get bitten. Damn it. Oh, God. Okay, so, uh... <laughs> this happens regardless. <sighs> Damn it. Alright. Well, this is gonna suck. This is gonna suck. God, you're so adorable, though. Hey, you don't eat it all. Yep. Damn you for being hungry. Why didn't I just dump some out on the ground? Why did I try to feed him from my hand? Dump it on the ground next time. Damn it, you don't mess with the hungry dog like that. Now you've been bitten. He's eating your food. Oh, God, no. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. It's worse than Lee. I can't hear the audio. I can't do it. You can't show. Ah, oh, God. Oh, it's the worst. Oh, it's the fuck- Dunno, I forgot this is what you were talking about. Oh, it's the fucking worst. Alright, come on, just let me do it. Put him out of his misery. This sucks. I hate this. Just fucking do it, Clem! Get it over with! Fuck. Oh, that's the worst. God, I'm gonna go hug my dog. Fuck, that's the worst. Ugh.
All right, what I miss? Uh, what did I miss? What happened? What happened? What did I miss? Just Emmy got a belly rub out of it, so. Fuck. All right, so did she just kill the dog and walk away? Is that all that happened? And now she's alone and upset and hurting, right? That's all I missed? I didn't miss nothing? Like there was no decisions or anything? <sighs> Fucking hell, that's the worst. Oh, that's the worst. Alright, so Dunham saying I didn't miss anything. Good. Fuck me, that... that sucked. He didn't miss any decisions. Okay, good. Jesus, I forgot about that part. That fucking blowed. Damn it. I remembered the dog attacking. I didn't remember the second part of it. I knew that the dog attacked. I didn't remember the second part of that. That sucked. Well, Shook, it's the feeling of a, you know, a pet being innocent as opposed to a human. Which, I mean, dogs aren't innocent and defenseless, but compared to, you know, a human, they are. So that's where that empathy comes from. Hello, random group of helpers. Plot armor strikes again. Nice shot. <sighs> I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Come on, kid. We gotta get <laughs> And we're off. God, that sucks. Sucks so bad. <laughs> so badly. But damn it, world, we, we made it through. I guess. Ah, oh, fuck, that was the first. The fuck were those things even doing there? I think. Get caught on. I think we're safe. Ugh. Yeah. Yeah, we're good. Hey, you all right? Hmm. Oh God. I, I think so. Well, cats better than dogs. Astro, I should slap you. Never mind. You can leave. Get out. What are you doing out here? Where are the, uh, the people you're with? There's no chance you made it this long on your own. I don't mm. want them thinking we're doing anything but trying to help you. Hmm. I'm not sure how the group's gonna feel about another mouth to feed. I'm alone. Everyone I know is gone. It's just me now. I'm sorry to hear that. I just lost a sister. Because as far as I know, Krista's dead, so it's fine. She well, was brutally attacked. Pyro, I'm just joking. Shit. This is Pete. Hey there. Hi. God, Pyro, you were on I'm a power Clementine. trip tonight. And it's nice to Shit. meet you, Clementine. And for now, we're gonna take you back to our group. Okay, we got a doctor with us, and you look like you could use some. Oh shit! <laughs> what? What is it? She's, she's been bit, man. Fuck. 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 What are we gonna do here? It's a dog. No, it was a dog. I didn't see any dog, Clementine. I can go back dog, and show man. you. We just saw you with those lurkers back there. I can't remember the last time I saw a dog. It was. I swear. Swearing doesn't make something so... No, no, no. I'm telling you the truth. Please. Hmm. All right. Let's see. Well, well you're easily Watch convinced. Us. Hey, don't look at me like that. You're the one that's bit here, okay? Is it, uh, is it like she says? Hmm. Well, it could be a dog. Hard to say. So where'd this dog go? The one that did this. But what, <sighs> what does that matter, Pete? Seriously. I, I killed it. What? Really? A dog shows up and bites you and you just kill it? What would you have done? I don't know. It attacked me. Still, you don't, you don't kill dogs. 
I agree with that statement, but shit. It's a mercy killing, man. Yes? You telling us the truth? You look me in the eyes, but you answer. Yes. All right, Clementine. That's good enough for me. Well, what else was she gonna say? I've got a good bullshit detector, Luke. That's why you can never beat me at poker. Actually, <laughs> fuck, Luke. You don't always beat me at... All right, how can you be sure? Well, I'm sure I ain't willing to leave a little girl in the woods to die when we got a doctor with us that can make a call. We can have Carlos take a look at it first. Nick ain't gonna like this. Not with what happened. You don't have to remind me of that, boy. Right. Sorry, sir. Come on. And we're off. I love how they got me this close to where they are, and they're just like, oh shit, look at the blood. Clementine, are you feeling all right? I'm fine. Just tired. Well, you better be fine, because I ain't carrying you anymore with that bite on your arm. Don't worry about... And much like Lee, oh, shit. we're going down. Just nothing but constantly falling. That's all the main characters in this game do, is just fall flat on their faces. It is the greatest, and I love it. What? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Uh, oh, my ass. Damn it. Do I have to be the man around? Shit. Keep your finger off the trigger, boy. Whoa! Whoa! What the you fuck? You idiot! Every lurker for five miles probably heard You're the that. one telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? I agree with him. Calm the hell down. We got a doctor right here. Okay, he'll have a look. Now what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational. You are being irrational, but... No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let me take a look. Let me look at what's happening. Here, let's... Okay. Trust me ahead, after okay. everything that's happened. Trust me, after one of one of my group members just yeah, fucking shot at you. It's a hell of a cup, by the way. Hmm. Whatever it was, it got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> I uh, know that worked for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We could try that. It won't do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. Uh, no one's going to volunteer to do that. I would, if it means saving I'm going to appeal to the doctor. How would we know it worked? Just let Carlos... You're a doctor, right? Aren't you supposed to help people that are hurt? I promise you, it was just a dog bite. That's all it was. We'll know soon enough, young lady. Who's she? Sarah. What I say, stay inside. <laughs> Get shit on, Sarah. Get shit on. Oh, God. I don't mean to be any trouble. I just want to stop the bleeding and then I'll go. You'll never see me again, I promise. And where exactly would you go? I can take care of myself. Clearly. Fuck you, bitch. Stand you scared. And I feel terrible delaying treatment. We've got to be sure. <sighs> so, what do you think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that? Could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? Oh. We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, if the fever set right in, day. we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. 
What about my arm? It needs to get cleaned and, and stitched and bandaged. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. Well, we have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by with it. Please. But yeah, we can't do nothing. I'm not wasting supplies on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. But... I'm sorry. It's the best we're gonna get. Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. It's all right. Boy's got his mom's temper. Come on. Yeah, she Shuck, that's too much logic, though, isn't it? And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the ship. Maybe you could let me go? I wish I could. I really do, but it's too risky. Sorry. Well... Dang, shh, with your logic. Don't be using logic here, man, because they're not. Into the shed we go. Nice cold shed. Because it's safer this way, and I'd rather be sure. I can't believe this. Now we must escape the shed. Is it Doug was with me right now? All right, no tools. It's in the tackle box. We're going fishing. Fishing for a new Doug. Not much left in here. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches. Climb your hardcore. I forgot, you stitch up your own wound, don't you? Fuck, okay, I know that board's there. So I'll look elsewhere. You can put your arm in the vise when you stitch it up. Keep it still. Anything else? Or put it on the table. Where's that going for us? Search the barrel in a minute. Grab the hammer. So short, grab the rake and use it to knock the hammer down. As long as you catch it and it doesn't hit the ground, they get pissed. Look at the anchor for no reason. This won't be important. It's just an anchor. Alright, so obviously we got that board. Let's double check the barrel. Nothing. Alright, if we. Looked at everything aside from the board. I think so. <coughs> ah, well, that works. Yeah, let's just go ahead and. <coughs> that had to hurt so badly. Are they not? Are they not pissed about the noise? Did they already leave? Also, fuck that hat. <laughs> I forgot about that part. That's brutal. <clears throat> All right, we have the hammer and a severely fucked up arm. All right, all well, that's good. Let's see if we can get the hell out of here. No, that's not... I mean, just put it, you know, on the nail. Yeah, that works too, but... I thought you were gonna be too loud about it. Alright, kicking's not a good idea. Alright, time for them to watch me escape. Like, really? They didn't, they didn't have anybody watch me? We have a doctor. 
gotta have stuff for I stitches. remember sneaking into the house, but I thought I got caught and put back first. Alright. And we're off. Find a way to sneak into the cabin. Can do. Can do. Took her hours to get out of that, apparently. Maybe the storm just rolled in really quickly. Open window. Open door. Open window. That's a bad idea. Open window. Another window. Just doing the old full detour. There we go. You have the hammer still, don't you? Why didn't let me use the hammer the first time? There you go, look at you using tools. They <laughs> grow up so fast. Alright. We're moving on. Alright. Do, 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 do. House meeting in five minutes. That's it. it won't take long. There's a few things we need to discuss. Fine. Right. Trap door. Who just has a trap door in their house? Really? Let's try the knife. Slip the lock with the knife. Did it, did it open at least? Okay. Oh, I guess I had to break it. If humans didn't have to. Yeah, void, I agree. I I love sleep, but hate sleep. Well, Luke has more so to hear you. Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of this. This will endear me to them, right? Sneaking into their house. My old group, we, we had candles. They can be of use to you. Okay. Listen at kitchen door. Are you in the kitchen? She said she's out here alone. Yeah, right. Whoever she's with. Alright, at least I know where they are. Where the hell are the stairs? At least I know they're in the kitchen. Sneaky, sneaky. It's a poster. Alright, this is uh, the bitch's room. I need to think of my kid's name. Clam, you're so sneaky. Splinter Cell style. Alright, let's uh, go dad away. We know they're in the kitchen. There's the stairs. Look at us now. We're on our way. I love how they positioned that to make it look like someone was going to pop up from the couch. Up we go. Okay. Bathroom door. Bathroom door is a good bet. Hey, medicine cabin. Baking soda, toothbrush, needle. Who leaves a needle in the bathroom? Who leaves a needle in the bathroom? What are you doing? I'll still you need some bandages and something to keep it from getting infected. 
Who keeps a needle in the bathroom, though? That doesn't... It doesn't make sense. Like, do you not have a... a you know, a... a freaking have have box for that? Around here somewhere. You know, fuck. Like, am I the am I the weird one here who's like, oh yeah, oh, my bathroom's full of needles. Like, what? Am I somehow the weird one? Who doesn't have that? We have a needle in my whole place. So it's like my mom. It's like you know, freaking sewing basket or yeah, sewing basket would be the right word. Hit her in the head with the hammer. Just need Am I being inconsiderate? Be Let it be okay. Let it be his. Wow. Cheating woman. Damn that cheating woman. <sighs> Damn that cheating woman. Chris the 2.0 because Telltale doesn't know how to make new characters, right? All right. Is there any other way out of here? No. Okay. Is the only bathroom in the house upstairs, by the way? All right. So we got bedroom one. We have bedroom two. And that's it. Door number one or door number two? Uh, door number one or door number two? Door number one's the one I'm next to. <laughs> I don't know which one to use, because one of them's the frickin' daughter's room and... fucking. Which one's the daughter? Okay, this looks like it'd have more of a master bedroom feel, because you wouldn't have the slanted roof. So I know if I lived here, I'd put my kid in this room. Go on with this room. Better not be the daughter's room. It is gonna be. Yep, shit. I reversed my own logic. I was supposed to use door number one. Whoops. You're not supposed to be in here. I done fucking fooled myself. Hold on. Damn it, there's no restart. I. What the fuck did I even just do? I'm like, oh, I should use the door. Yeah, I'd put my kid in that room, so let me go into that. The fuck's the matter with me? What just happened? Did I, pa did I pass out? What year is it? What even just happened? Fuck! What just happened? Hi. Can you please help I'm me? So, what the fuck? I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. Oh, God. Me, and I won't tell him. I... I'm hurt. Please help me. Is there anything in the... I shouldn't. ...the other room that I needed? <laughs> what happened to you? A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurts. I could die if I don't take care of it. Do you understand? I need something to clean it up. And something to wrap it with. A clean bandage. I think you can still go to the other room? I hope so. Are you feeling it now, Mr. Tukes, right? That's what this applies. I'll help you. Good. Thank you. I'm just... I'm Sarah. I'm Clementine. Nice eyes. We're friends. 2018. Right? We can be best sure? friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. And if her baby is a girl, it'll be forever before she's old enough to, like, be my friend. And then I'll be super old. Yes. We are friends. Promise? It's important. <sighs> friends have to trust each other, no matter what. I promise. Me too. Friends. Yeah. I'm just... I Like, I just... Pinky swears forever. Like, I fucking Jedi mind tricked so myself I'm into opening the wrong door. <laughs> Let me look around. Like, my head hurts after that. Like, what the fuck just happened to me? I 
think this is it. That'll work. You can't do it here, though. Someone will find you. Don't worry. I won't. Fuck. Okay. I'm just... Like, man, I'm just... Thanks, Sarah. Jesus. <sighs> Manipulating an injured little kid to be your friend, <laughs> right? You still need bandages. I sure do. Damn it. Damn it all. Alright, well, we're where we're supposed to be, at least. Even if how I got here wasn't exactly in the right way. Look at board game. Open wardrobe door. Search wardrobe. Pick up rags. I I'm can pick up exactly rags. Bandages, but they should help stop the bleeding. I'm not gonna steal your watch. No, I'm not. No, that's a bad idea. <laughs> what the fuck do I need a watch for? I'm not gonna steal a goddamn watch. Come on. Oh. Look at board game. Take the watch because it gets left behind. No, I'm not taking the watch because they'll find it on me and think I'm an asshole. Take the watch because it gets left behind. I'm not taking it. No. In my state of current confusion, I don't care if it's a spoiler. You need to, why do I need the watch? I don't want to be labeled a thief. I'm, I'm an injured nine-year-old, not a thief, damn it. Granted, she might be ten at this point, but you get the point. Take the watch because it gets left behind. It doesn't make sense. Who cares if it gets left behind? Left behind by whom? Who would I possibly need to convince that, oh, hey, I have this watch for trading. Who the fuck cares about a watch? You better have a good damn explanation. I'm not taking it. There's no way. No. Dag, you've got about two seconds. Just take it, you need it for later. Nope, not, not, not a good enough explanation to me. I'm leaving it. I'm not a thief. Unless he stole it from someone else, and that's why I'm supposed to take it. Mm-hmm-hmm. <laughs> Did you take the gold watch? I did not take the gold watch. Uh. Uh. Fuck. Uh. God. Uh, explanation of someone dies, a nephew of someone who dies, leaves it here by accident. <sighs> well... <sighs> oh, Jesus. Alright. Fuck it. I'm taking it, I guess. Screw it. That's what they want me to think. They don't want me to take it. Ah, fuck. Alright, I might regret this, but fuck it. Alright, fuck it. We're taking it. It's too late. It's already done. If I get caught for being... Well, what's the worst that happens if I get caught for being a thief? They're not gonna kill me in the second game. It's just the second game. So yeah, fuck it. I'll steal shit. No problem. Creaky ass floorboards. Alright, just get back to the exit. No need to lollygag. Just get back to the exit. You're also literally stealing their supplies. Yeah, fair point. I am I am stealing their shit already, aren't I? But that's a personal item. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know, man. I'm in a weird headspace after the whole freaking, like, fucking Psyduck performed confusion 
on himself. Like just, ugh, I'm in a weird spot. All right, let's patch this baby up. Give yourself a different rag to scream into. <laughs> this is gonna suck. This is put your arm suck. in. Yeah, yeah, it is. Just put your arm in the vise. Put your arm in the vise. That'll be better. Okay, first up, let's clean this bad boy. All right, again, you might want to, uh... Mm -hmm. Yeah, you might you might have wanted something to scream into. That would have been a good idea. Okay. Yeah, that would have been good. As someone who was bit by a dog and had to go through, I mean, granted, it wasn't a self-patch up, but boy. Now the fun part. Aren't dog bites just the best? All right. Well, all right, let's patch this baby up. Let's do it. Thread the needle. Why do I have to do it? Do it for me. There you go. Now, all right. Just like last time. Just how Krista showed me. Krista taught you how to sew wounds closed? <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, what? Ah! Yeah! I mean, in fairness. Yeah, I guess so. That would make sense now, wouldn't it? I mean, in fairness, you could have... There could have been some way to kind of numb the skin a little bit. You could have, you could have found a way. All right, next one. Yeah. This is rough. But we'll laugh our way through it. Not really laugh our way through, but that is rough. Yikes. One more time. Goodness. Goodness gracious. That's, that's, oh God, just bouncing around and shit. This is rough. This is, this is not, this is not a fun time. We're on the verge of passing out. Yikes! That's that'll wake you up quick. That'll that'll wake you up right quick. There you go. This is this is not pleasant. <laughs> like this just isn't pleasant. Not even a watch that hurts to hear. I agree. This is just not a fun time. Yeah, right, you might want to close up that little end bit there. No? That's it? You're just going to leave that little end bit open? Yeah, Boxer, right? Incoming gangrene. There's a clean needle until you put it in your pocket. <sighs> Why are you always dropping? Alright, what's well, going to jump out at me? Here it comes! <laughs> in the coffin. Ah, That's not good. Ah, wait, what? Ah, oh, there's nothing over there. Let me look over here. Grab the rake. Fucking grab it. I did not miss that trigger press, damn it. Get off of me. Grab the rake. Hit him with the rake. Put him into the anchor. It's still there. Pale him. Yeah. Anchors away. Approaching your death. He lived through that? Damn it, 
Well, I mean, you're still at a three to four swing kill ratio. There you go. Ah, poor Randall. Poor Randall. Holy shit. What the... How the hell did he get in here? Little girl's tough as nails. Are you all right? Are you happy? I could have died, you know. Well, you didn't. I'm gonna Just fucking slash your throat. <laughs> you patched yourself up? Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from us? I sure did. This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to Says us. Says the man not carrying a baby. Enough already. I did. I took stuff. And I'm sorry. I really am. And you think you can trust her? God damn it, don't even start. Any of you would have done the same if you were half as tough as this little girl. So right? just save it. Big bunch of pansies. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. Damn lurker sneaking around out here. We better get inside. You hungry? Was I supposed to have a question uh, attempt there, or was it just like, eh, silence for effect? Is that how that was supposed to happen? I can't believe how intimidated they are by a ten-year-old. This might hurt a little. What the fuck? How she look? Her suturing skills need some work. But otherwise, I say she should be fine. So, it wasn't a lurker bite? If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. Big, I hear you. I wish you wouldn't have done what you did. I was hurt, and you weren't helping. Because we considered you a threat, which you were. Hmm. Maybe you still are. No, I'm not. We put you in that shed out of concern for the safety of our loved ones. And then you escaped and persuaded my daughter to steal from us. Mm-hmm. I sure did. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially, but once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. If she knew how bad the world is, what it's really like out there, she would cease to function. She's my little girl. Take go to bed. She's all I have left, and I would ask that you stay away from her. <sighs> I'm sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. You're forgiven. Just don't make any nice, more nice mistakes. for the moment. Until I stab you in the neck. Eventually. With your bulgy ass eyes, dude. Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. Why did it look like why did that look like the paper to Wonder Bread? <laughs> like look at the colors! Like I brought you a Wonder Bear. I brought you the bag for That's Wonder Bread. Car. Enjoy it. It's fucking. It's great. It's a bit clingy. I completely missed what he said. Sorry. What'd you say? It's gonna leave a hell of a scar. You're gonna leave a hell of a. What? Oh boy. Uh, better than losing it. Losing it. Now you can say that again. Scars? They're way cooler than stumps. That's a lie. Stumps Definitely. are pretty sweet. Why are you so brooding? Cheer up. What is it, the zombie apocalypse or something? Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry for well, for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro, and that was definitely not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. You were just mm. protecting your friends. I get it. Well, we'll be, be so hard. We'll be understanding just, for the moment. Uh, we had a bad experience once. We've all had bad experiences. Nick lost his mom. 
We took care of someone who got bit. It was my fault. I... It was no one's fault. It was your fault, Nick. We thought we could control it, but we couldn't. And then she turned, and his mom was standing right there, and she got attacked. And there was nothing we could do about it. Hmm. Anyway. A button sharpens the spoon so you can gut them with it. I don't know, but I want to know. Uh, wait, what? Fuck. Every time I pay attention. Hopefully you understand. Uh, yeah. Fuck it. I do. Yeah. It's like, are we missing a spoon, Clem? No, no, I don't know nothing about that. I did my dishes. I handed my dishes to Luke. Uh, to, I handed my dishes to Jim. So, Jim? Since uh, you're Tom. pretty much on your own. Luke! Oh, Luke! Point. Okay. Fuck me, I can't, I can't. Like, I'm just, I'm off my game, totally. It's pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I don't fucking know, buddy. Uh, don't know. I don't know. I'm kind of on my own now. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Okay, let yourself heal up. Take some time to sort things out. Can't pay attention. Twenty-four. It's true. Everyone else will be okay with it. They'll just have to deal with it, won't they? So, what happened to your parents? If you don't mind me asking. Why are you asking a kid about her dead parents that she's not with? What happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. They died. That's tough. I, uh, I lost my folks, too. Hey, ten-year-old, let's talk about your dead parents. Hey, I'm sorry. What's the matter with you? I shouldn't have asked. You're right, you shouldn't have. Oh, God. My parents went the door on vacation. Paradox has and cussed me? It might have. And they never came back. Their brain's in gridlock right now. Find them, but they were already dead. Wow. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, boy. This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors, and we all tried to make it. But it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. He sure did. He's the reason I keep my hair short. What uh, happened to him? What do you think? He's not... Oh, God. The same thing that happens to everyone. But he saved me first. What the fuck do you think happened to him? He's not here with me right now, is he? Like he was a real good guy. He was, and you're an yeah. idiot. He was. Fucking, you see that face right there? He and I have one thing in common tonight, right? Like, this is it. This is what, like, right now. Luke, me, this is the same thing. That's all we got going on in our head right now. This is it. Okay, maybe Luke has the slightly different version. But, that's it. That's it. And this might happen to me. <laughs> this might happen to me later. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck. Well, there you go. There you go. Keep talking, buddy. I hate to interrupt, but I'm no, out there standing and watch, and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in anyways. Now get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. A couple fresh brookies for dinner? Don't call them brookies. Wouldn't that be nice? Don't do it. Roll for initiative. <laughs> You're still here. I am. I wouldn't get comfortable if I were you. Oh, boy. Whose baby is it? Fucking roasted, bitch. How do you feel? It's not Alvin's. Whose is it? 
You shut your fucking mouth. You shut your fucking mouth. You should probably think about being nicer to me. Revenge. That's just my advice. Revenge. I knew you were going to be a fucking problem. You got what you came here for. Now go. First chance to tell her off, I had to. <laughs> I'm sorry. I could have played nice, but fuck that. Now we're on a mutual understanding. You're a two time and damn that cheating woman. And yeah. That's that, Rebecca. You gotta use her. She did. Speaking of getting what you deserve, uh, I'm gonna get what I deserve, which is a fucking drink. Do -do -do. All right, let's do it. So we just told uh, some lady to pretty much go fuck yourself. That was the last thing that we did. Christopher Walken dead. Indeed. How you holding up? I heard you got an earful from Rebecca. <laughs> Dice uh Oh. Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. Hold on. Uh, talking to Rebecca. Oh, I was talking to Rebecca. I'd laid down the law. Gotta turn that back up, actually. Um, hmm. Her bark's worse than her bite. Uh. She's all talk. She doesn't scare me. She was in a mood last night. That's for sure. Yeah, she was. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. It's gonna shoot you out here, Clem. <laughs> You're not getting back. Anyone teach you how to shoot? By that I mean taught proper. Any yeah, idiot with a finger can shoot. Talk about Lee. Ants is the best My movie. It's, Lee it's, it's number three on it's the good. list. It's important nowadays. Is there a podcast dedicated to talking about underrated animated films like Oliver and Company, We're Back, and Ants? If not... I think I can corner that market. So I could talk about ants for hours. Turkey told Rebecca, don't you forget that. True. Nick was about True. your age. First time I took him hunting. Indeed. Came across this beautiful 13 point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle, he lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. Oh, that's sad. Hey! Why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway, so I grabbed the gun Roasted. out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the gun fires. The boy nearly gut shot me. And of course, the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Because you almost blew her <clears throat> face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. Fucking roast. I apologized already. She accepted. Okay, well I didn't know that. That's gonna be quiet. <laughs> it's a valid option. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Fight, fight, Leaving fight, us again. fight. I know where the fucking river is. Yeah, you do. Tension. So anyway, I found that buck later that season. Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play around. Oh, that's because you were hunting for the hell of it. You love, Did you need to? Did you need to shoot the deer or did you want to shoot the deer? I completely missed what he said because I was sharing my opinion on hunting. Uh, sometimes you gotta play a role even if Papa da. Uh... Oh, God. Sometimes you gotta play a role, huh? Oh, let's, uh... Yeah. You should tell him that. Yeah, be honest. Bring down those walls. Let your emotions run wild. Uncle Pete! It's Yogi! He's in the trap! I'm sorry. Nick! I know, Snipe. I told you I was gonna switch, though. <clears throat> Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Dunno, I couldn't tell you the last time I saw... Uh, I couldn't tell you the last time I saw Ants, though, to be honest. Is this app? Yeah, Ryan Minister. This is game number two. And in fairness, Lee didn't shoot himself. Ah, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet. 
But it ain't your average gang of thugs. That Ganga. G A N G. Think about it. Your Carver, what do you do? Oh, Who's so Carver? Good. Ganga. Check those guys there. The music, the tension. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. Tension's out of control. Oh, talk to Pete. I don't want to talk to Pete. I don't want to do nothing. I don't know. I just talk to Pete. Talk to Pete enough. Look at Sandbar. There are more out there. This wasn't no rinky dink pissant match. What was it then? Fubar. Where are you going? We need to get the fuck out of here. Gotta check the rest. What? Why? Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down? We gotta get out of here now! Jesus Christ, get a hold of yourself! What if someone's alive, Nick? Who cares? Cause they might just be inclined to tell us who did this. We gotta do this now. Stay here. Keep searching these. This is a dumb idea. You know, Nick, I don't like this either. But sooner or later, you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever gonna give a goddamn whether you like something or not. You gotta grow up, son. Whatever. Come on, Clem. You wanna be useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this mess, just like baiting a fish. It's what I'd do. I'm on it. You always so agreeable? No. Good. You'll fit right in with this outfit. I'll, I mean, I'm new here. I don't want to push my luck about, hey, give me a gun. You know? That's a, that's a bit too much. Same deal. All shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. No. Good. Awkward. <laughs> this is the, uh... More the origin story of Aquaman. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. About time by the end of the game, he just starts carrying a trident. I'd lose my mind. Alright, buddy. You wanna wake up? Rise and shine, sweetie. It's time to get up. <gasps> wow. Do we still have that spoon? I think so. <coughs> what happened to you? <coughs> you were in the woods with Krista. The woman I was with. What happened to her? Please, tell me. Tell me. <coughs> And kick the bucket. Now's the time. Ah, oh, boy. <coughs> ah. <coughs> now tell me. I'm fine. Just are you though, Pete? Just lost my footing. Damn it! God damn it! Lurkers! You're dead, Pete. About You're dead. Come this way, bitch. Damn it! You get your asses over here, both of I'll you. I'll cover you. We gotta get out of. Okay, so Pete, Pete's dead. Pete just got bitten. Pete just got bit. Could, yeah, could go one-footed. Use the spoon. <laughs> Alright, who's, who's over this yeah. way? Get over here, goddammit! Can't on. you listen to me once? Just one time? I've got ammo! I'm coming, Pete. Maybe, if it wants to load. Come on! Come on! Jesus! Come on! Yeah, just go ahead and grab that board right here and just uh, hit him upside the dang old head right there. Or hit him in the arm. That works too. 
Sweet Letterman's jacket, though. Nick! Hold on! Nick! You want to move? God damn it! Nick! There you go. Look at go. you using your feet. Ah, I'm sure everything will be fine. No problems here. Everything, everything will be fine. What are you gonna do? Someone's outside. Let's saw off the foot. Someone came here looking for you. A man. What? Did he say what his name was? We know damn well who it was. Who is he? One of the guys we were with before. What's he gonna do? I didn't realize that was the end of the chapter. I can't keep going. I figure we got about four, five more days to reach those mountains. We ain't here to rob nobody. Just relax and put the gun down, man. I thought you were dead. Dun, dun, dun. Cliffhanger. All right. So what do we have for choices then? Did you try to save Krista? Uh, only fifty. Wow. You know what? In fairness, I'm surprised I was in the majority with trying to save Krista in the woods. Fifty-two. Uh, imagine not putting down the dog. Imagine the dog getting fucking impaled and you don't put it down. What kind of monster are you? Freaking forty-eight percent of people are sick. Uh, 50% accepted Nick's apology, 43% mad. People, people didn't want to give water to the dying man, huh? And 60% went with Pete. Kick rocks, Nick. Kick rocks. Indeed, indeed, Dig. Like I said, I remember, I, you know, would have watched the majority of this game, uh, via YouTube, uh, playthrough. But, you know. Alright, do I have to? Let me out! Let me out. Okay, well, we're here for now. How are you? Happy to hear it. What you you hold doing poorly? Your every okay, I'm not listening to that song. Not gonna do it. Life is for the yeah, living. well, Prime Minister, we, we round up around these parts here. Kent Muddle. Might as well look for the great names. Like Ryan with two N's Weller because his parents don't know how to spell. Where are you too high? Anybody else with an interesting name to me? Make it interesting for me. Against the right time, choice. We'll see. Struggle. We'll see. The right choices to you aren't the right choices to everyone, man. Against the time, struggle. Emmy Batista. What? Our heads right. above the tea. Okay. I'm, I'm digging it. The hearts above the line. Anybody else? Sean Vanaman. Vanaman. Hey, my name's actually spelled Ryan. Well, Ryan, I hate to tell you this. The parents don't know how to spell. We ought to just tack on an extra N for emphasis. Larry Weiner. Alright. Goodbye, Larry Weiner. Not in that way. Maybe. Who knows? Kid Beyond! What? Kid... Kid Beyond. Are you kidding me? Kit, real name Andrew Chalkin. Yeah, that, yeah, no wonder. Come on now, Chalkin. What are you doing? What are you doing? I don't want to cut off the credits because there might be some better names. We'll get back to Mr. Kid Beyond. Unreal. Emmy Batista again. What a champion. Job J. What? Job J. Stauffer. What the hell is even happening? What is even going Never on with these names? Evan Cooked. Stan Shambaugh. That's a solid name. First round pick in the OHL draft. Stan Shambaugh. I like it. Alex Dudley. Bear Bear. Special thanks to Bear Bear. Come on. Come on, Bear Bear. Oh, goodness. Bear Bear. Catherine Schroesvold in caps, because you have to yell it for whatever reason. Bear, bear. 
Osage Western, the Rhode Island Stirp Clan. Okay. This is. Oh boy, we got Kinsey the dog face, Max the dog, Mighty Pirate Pete, Momo, Mr. Bix, Nugget. These are all cats and dogs for sure. Yes, the child. the cat. Case in point. And shout out to Walter. The dead dog from the first game. Good old Walter. Except he's German, so I'm calling him Walter. Alright, so let's uh let's talk about Kid Beyond here, shall we? So this is Kid Beyond, real name Andrew Chiken. Not I thought that was an L, it's Andrew Chiken. Okay. Voice actor, singer, beatboxer, throat singer, songwriter, and live looper. Based in San Francisco. K. He, he did a voice in SOCOM Navy SEALs? What? Like the good one? What was the one that... I don't even remember the one that I played. Was it this one? No, that wasn't the one that I played. Hold on, we gotta find the uh, old SOCOM game that I used to play. It was sick. No, that wasn't it either. Damn it, there was a SOCOM game that I played. It was, the, it was my jam for a bit. And it's none of those. We will find it. We won't find it. I don't know where it is. Never mind. Who cares? Well, Kid Beyond. That's all you gotta know. Kid Beyond. Uh, Nasty Thought was better. Nasty Thought is the hero and champion that we all deserve. He really is. A house divided. <laughs> 